This month, Saudi Arabia has become home to some of the world's finest visualization labs. King Abdullah University of Science and Technology has invested heavily in displaying data in a visually attractive and informative way with help from the University of California, San Diego's CalIT2. On my tour today of the visualization suite, several applications were being demoed on the displays, including a DNA visualization in 3D that doesn't require those hokey glasses. But my eyes were actually drawn to this display of information flow in the brain. Here's research scientist Chris Knox. The, the questions that, that has been pursued with this is trying to understand which parts of the brain are connected and uh, where, uh, where messages that are generated with one part of the brain flow uh, to, to other parts of the brain. Basically, from scanning of a human brain, um, and so what the scanning uh, is is looking for is the way that uh, water flows inside the brain, uh, and then from that, neurologists are able to identify where messages are passed in the brain, and then identify which uh, regions of the brain uh, basically are connected and where where messages go. So the water is kind of a proxy for the messages. So where, where water is flowing in the brain is, is where the messages are also flowing. 